When I first started driving, these lovely ladies were going to Mexico. I think I'm going to like this job. I gave a ride to Gary Filibuster's voice in the series Fairy Tale. Thank you, Newton, for allowing me to post. Good afternoon, and these folks already started the party. They were from Boyd, Texas, and were going to Fair Park in Dallas to the 15th annual Mardi Gras Texas style. I asked if girls got topless like in New Orleans, and Travis said, Why do you think I have all these beads around my neck? This was the second time from Arlington to Berry Street tattoos with the guys. Even though I don't have a tattoo, I have learned a lot on the rides. The friend freckle, white tats, and the different places TCU co-eds place and hide their tattoos. I enjoyed your ride with a great bunch of guys. I picked up this nice young couple from York, England, and they were in Texas for the first time. They were excited about being here and attending the WWE WrestleMania 32 at AT&T Stadium. We discussed gun control since England has the toughest gun laws in the world. Even the police don't carry guns. Their destination? Shoot Smart Gun Range in Grand Prairie. I picked up Nis, who just arrived the day before from Denmark. He finished playing disc golf at Veterans Park in Arlington. He walked from Knight's End by Six Flags. It was a 10 mile hike. A kind person flying a drone used his Uber account for his ride back. Nis is a teacher and loves disc golf. Over the next two weeks, he will be playing tournaments in Cedar Hill and McKinney. He is single, 37 years old, and a free spirit with no real itiner itinerary or vehicle. I gave him my cell phone number just in case he needed any help. I told him to think of me as his American father. Good luck, Nis. I picked up a lovely couple at the Arlington Sheraton. Their destination was returning home to Louisville. The happy couple were married the night before at the Milestone in Denton. Friends and family did not know a helicopter was going to land and whisk the newly married couple away. On the night flight, to the Sheraton, they flew down the middle of DFW Airport over AT&T Stadium and Globe Life Park. Good luck, Brad and Jessica. I enjoyed the trip. My first trip made my day. I took three lovely and tall ladies from to play the Mercury. Courtney, number three, OU. Teresa, number 55, LSU and Jordan, number 35, from Nebraska, are with our new WNBA Dallas Wings. Good luck tomorrow night. I enjoyed the trip. Oh, by the way, they won. It was a pleasure giving Hakeem a ride and talking about his goals. He graduated from Bowie High School and is pursuing a singing career. I would like to see him succeed. I picked up four lovely and funny ladies in Louisville. Destination was the Ice House in Bedford. After that, next door to the movie tavern premiere of Fifty Shades Darker. Entertainment provided by LaBear Dancers. Their faces and names withheld for obvious reasons. Have fun, ladies. After picking up five visiting French ladies at the Omni Hotel in Dallas, our destination was the Texas Horse Park. I said hi to one of my friends. I took five lovely TCU seniors to Joe T. Garcia's in North Fort Worth. They will be graduating next week. Good luck in your future endeavors, ladies. I picked up Logan and Liam at DFW Airport going to Denton. They are sound engineers who live in Nashville, Tennessee and come to Texas when Cody Jenks is performing. They also work for other famous artists. Great conversation.